with less than 12 hours left till the official release of Shining Legends, I thought and asked myself, what can we open to kind of help introduce and fall through into the new Shining Legends set? And then I sneak peeked a little bit of... The Pikachu Shining Legends Pin Collection Boxes. We're going to be opening up two of them today on Poke the Monster. So guys, stay tuned. Let's get through that intro. And hopefully we can get as amazing pulls as we did in that ETB. What's going on everybody and welcome to another episode on Poke the Monster. So like I said, we're going to be opening up two, not one, but two of these Pikachu pin collection boxes. Now, what does each of these pin collection boxes have? Well, it's slightly different from the old mythical collection, so definitely look into that before you just um before you you say anything as far as the pricing. Because if I'm not mistaken, these are $15.99 each retail. That being said, each one comes with a foil uh promo card, just like the old pin collection, the uh mythicals. They also come with a pin, just like the pin collections. I'm and then, I'm sorry, just like the mythicals, I keep messing that up. But, not two, three packs are in these. They come with a total of three, where the old generations only came with two. So you get an extra pack out of this, which it's like, well, it's an extra pack. Yeah, that's 50% more. There were two, now there's three. So that's 50% more product, technically, for, I believe, the exact same price. So, guys, let's get ripping into this. I'm going to do each box at a time to try to get an idea of what the pull rate's going to be. All right, so let's rip this puppy open. We're going to take a quick look at Pikachu himself as well. And then we're going to get cracking into these packs. All right, let's see. Come on, Pikachu. Out you come. There you go. All right, then we got one, two, and three, and the pin. Okay, so we're just going to do a quick little run over this one, and then the next one we're just going to go straight to the packs. There you go. There's Pikachu. Awesome looking card. I really do like the artwork. It really is incredible. It's very different from everything else, everything else that I've ever seen. And promo number is, I don't know if you guys can see it, promo number is SM76. So number 76, and then of course we've got the Pikachu pin. Such a cute little pin. I really do like it. Adding that onto the collection, let's get a sleeve. Oh, damn, gotta grab sleeves. Got me sleeves. All right, this pack's got Two Rayquaza, one Mewtwo. So, let's do one of the Rayquazas first. Then we'll do a Mewtwo, and then top it all off with the second Rayquaza. Now, obviously, the code doesn't matter. They're all going to be white codes, but I'll tell you what. Bam! Free codes for you guys. One, two, three, four, and two. All right, let's see what we get. All right, Water Energy. Energy Retrieval. A, fl uh, wow, Floatzel, had a brain fart for a second, Switch, followed by a Spiritomb, Reverse Hollow, and the rare card is a Latios Holographic Rare. Now, for those of you who haven't seen any other Shining Legends boxes being opened, every single pack is guaranteed a Holographic. Not just a Reverse Hollow, at least a Holographic. So... You will always get at least a holographic. That being said, that is why they're all white codes. So no, they are not weighable. Or are they? I don't know. Leave it down in the comment section below. Do you guys want me to do a video to see if these are weighable or not? Definitely let me know and we can definitely do that. I think I've got a scale somewhere around that I could try to use for this. All right, pack number two. Let's see, we got a Fighting Energy, another, oh, wow. Way to totally mess that one up. Well, and then we've got an Eveltal, a <laughs> rare holographic. All right, let's go through the rest of the pack at least. All right, wait, oh, I dropped another one. At least I didn't drop the rare card, right? All right, so we've got a Switch, another Floatzel, a... Carni 
Carnivine? We'll go with a Carnivine. All right, sounds good. And the reverse hollow was a Zorua. That's a pretty cute looking Zorua. All right, we'll sleeve those up in a second. Let's try to not mess this one up completely. That'd be great. Absolutely wonderful. Code card for you guys. One, two, three, four, and two. Okay. Let's see, let's see. So we've gotten two hollow rares. Hopefully we can get something better. We got, ooh, there we go. Warp energy, very cool. I like that warp energy. Followed by an electrode. Another floatzel, wow, seems to be a common one. Manaphy reverse holographic rare. Very cool, but our rare card is a Zekrom. Hollow rare. Really cool card though. All right, so the first box kind of ended up being a bit of a dud. Nothing, nothing great at all. Because, like, the hollow rares are, like, equivalent to pretty much what, like, non-hollow rares were before. All right, so that's box number one. Let's get ripping right into box number two. Let's sleeve up Pikachu. And then we've got two Mewtwo and a Rayquaza. So we'll start off with a Mewtwo pack. All right, next code for you guys. Bam, Shining Legends code. Enjoy that. I'm not even going to bother asking to leave it down in the comment section below of what you get because nobody ever seems to want to. All right, so we've got a Fighting Energy. Another Carnivine, Ultra Ball, a Damage Mover, Reverse Hollow is a DCE. Nice, DCE Reverse Hollow, but our rare card is a Shaman Hollow Rare. <coughs> oh, had a little of a tickle in the throat. Okay, next pack. Mewtwo. Why? Just because. With a Pikachu on the front. Aw, oh, look at him. Code card. Bam. One, two, three, and a two. Okay, let's see what we get. We've got a Fairy Energy. Another Carnivine. Switch. Arbuck. Reverse Hollow is an Ekans, and the rare card is a Raikou. Wow, Raikou, yeah, that's a really cool looking Raikou. That is an awesome, he, he's just looking at us just like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do about it? That's a pretty cool looking art, I really gotta say. All right, let's pop that right there. Sleeve up Ekans, all right, last pack guys. Last pack magic. Let's see if we can get anything epic at all. Hopefully we can. Because it's been quite quite a bit of a disappointment so far. There you go. Code for you guys. One, two, three, and a two. Last pack magic steel energy. Incineroar. Didn't even know that was in the set. Sophocles. Great Ball, Reverse Hollow is, a Spiritomb, and our final rare card is a Keldeo Hollow Rare. Wow, so pulling anything from these is going to be really, really hard. Well, we're going to be opening up two more Mewtwo boxes in the next video, so hopefully we can get something better from that one. But as always, guys, hopefully you guys like the video. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to, to hit that subscribe button if you haven't do, done so already and you're new to the channel. 
That being said, over there is going to be the subscribe button, just in case you haven't done so already. Over there is going to be a previous video, so you can check out some more of the content. But as always, guys, till next time, peace out, everybody!